I am Andres Armua, I am from Argentina, and I study how unpredictable and how chaotic uh, things like the air or water in the oceans are, or even intergalactic medium in the outer space. The reason I wanted to study in Edinburgh was that, first of all, I fell in love with the city when I started to look at pictures and hear about the Fringe Festival and many other cultural interesting things that are in the city. Also, the program of physics in the university was very broad and wide and versatile for me to develop a more complete career, I think. So that's the reason I chose Edinburgh the first time. So the pros of having kids during the PhD, the first one that comes to my mind is that after I finish the PhD and start a new job, I already have three kids that are not so young, so I can dedicate to my, to my job in a different way. The other pro is that you have quite a flexible schedule. Um, you can work out of hours and you can, especially more after the pandemic, uh, employers and PhD supervisors were aware that students can work from home and being productive. Well, the cons of being a parent when you are doing a PhD is that you always feel that you could be doing much more. But to be honest, if you weren't a parent, you will probably be doing other things instead of parenting and you will be losing your time other, in other ways. I also think one of the hardest challenges of being a student parent is that there's not enough time to make friends and most of your friends will be like gathering after you finish your work day and maybe you have other responsibilities. But there's still room for that and I found that many of my colleagues were really keen to come and meet my family and I was able to make friends through the PhD and that was really nice. There is a growing network of students parents of the university that is really helpful and really supportive and you can talk about whatever you're feeling or you're going through. Even if you didn't move to Edinburgh yet and you have a lot of questions and concerns, you can share that in the group and they are really supportive and they will help you. I would really advise you to join that group. I don't know, any moment of your life is good for having kids, and it's not good for having kids in the same way, but it is possible to balance both things in the end.